Hello everyone, welcome back to my HoloLens update. Uh, today I would like to show you something that popped up on the Microsoft Windows Store um, for the HoloLenses. So this is ActionGram. It's currently in beta. So as you can see, I set up some characters here uh, from their menu before. Uh, you can essentially pick any of these characters here. However, you will need to download them from the cloud each time. So I just downloaded two of them. Uh, what's cool about this is that these animations are basically captured using a green room with multiple cameras. So they're very good real life characters with very detailed texture for them. Once I play the video, you'll see even better. So here is George Takei. Okay. There you go. So it is very cool. Um, and uh, one more thing I noticed is that you get a lot of options for adjusting. They basically made it such that as soon as you raise your hand, the menu appears. And you can use your gaze to use any options. For example, there's move, resize, rotate, and they even have a, one more level of adjustment such as this. Let's try it. So you can look at the sound, I guess the brightness, okay, and uh, record autoplay, or you can even add a tint to it. Let's try that. Let's say just, oh, not sure why. Okay, there you go. Made him a little bit uh, cyan color. Now back to this. So um, here is the menu and on top of it, I don't need to go through all the tutorial items with you. However, I just noticed there is something called a budget, which they didn't really talk about. And whenever I want to put in something in here, I have to think about my budget. In this case, I already put in two clips and very soon you will see that I cannot put in a third clip. For example, I want to put granny in there it says maximum number of clips re reached. So basically it's telling me I can only put these two clips in here. I guess as a feedback for the beta, I would definitely want to be able to put more clips in here. Um, now let's take a look at this animation as well. It's also kind of cool. Okay. So one other difference between Action Grant and the apps that I was building with some animated game characters is that these animations are all directly filmed uh, using multiple cameras whereas my animations was based off some uh, animation package and then mapped, uh, mapped separately to uh, separately modeled game characters. So I guess in my version I would have allowed a lot more variability because uh, there are just so many possible animation motions that you can do. Great job! Great job to the Action Grand team. And uh, I really look forward to see a lot more exciting stuff showing up on the, um, available clips. And uh, just make the budget bigger. And then we can come up with some really cool movies here. Thank you.